Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. I'm a serious JG and we're teleporting around like crazy. It's time for us to leave the cabin of the Stolen Faith because we don't have enough money to buy the Stolen Faith. The Faith, I'm starting to think, stole itself from whatever temple it was in so that it could set up a shop as a Faith for Hire. Uh, at any rate, it's time for us to return to the main quest. And uh, I hope you enjoyed those brief moments of Lulu having a character. Wasn't really all that terribly compelling or exciting, unfortunately, for Lulu fans, but that's about the end of it. From now on, any Lulu or, or Waka plot character development is just going to be them reacting to things that happen to Yuna and Titus, because they're the stars, and Lulu and Waka are not. Come on, there's got to be something hidden over here. Maybe we go all this way for nothing. There was like a little thing here. Do we not encounter enemies here? Gonna be another boss fight here? No? Okay. So, yeah. It, the, the Guardian's just ignoring Yuna here. Interesting choice. Sometimes Yuna would just stare off into the distance. I'm thinking about naked men. I finally understood why. She was thinking about naked men. Why? You gonna tell us, or? Thank you for noticing she was me. saying goodbye to the places she'd never see again. She was saying, thank you for noticing me staring off in the distance. She's saying goodbye to some bridge that she'd never seen before, would never see again. Mount Gagazette to Xanarkand Ruins. Oh. Appear that we're, uh... Getting along here on the map. Yeah. Remember, Besaid is all the way to the very south. So you can see where we are now. Apparently that huge continent that we barely seem to explore included uh, Bazel, R Bavel is like continent size I guess, but oh well. Gagazette Mountain Gate. Sudden shift from the calm plains to snowy mountains, but hey, that's how these games roll. I really need some longer pants. I'm fine, baby. I got fur to protect me. Summon Ayuna and Guardians. Leave here and How come once. you speak so properly, Daddy? Gagazette is Ronso land. Sacred mountain. Sacred mountain of Sloda. The mountain will not bear the footsteps of infinite. The mountain would totally collapse under your weight. Enemy of Yevon is enemy of Ronso. Leave, traitors! I have cast aside Yevon. I... I follow the temple no more. You shouldn't have said then that, then. you will die by those words. You live by the temple, and you so die by the temple. Yevon has warped the teachings and betrayed us all. Nothing but a bunch of low-down tricksters, eh? Yeah, 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 yeah! That's right, bitches! We have no regrets. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, they almost had like a horn off there, but the summoner and her guardians. Lord Kelgranso, if I may, have you not also turned your back on Bavel? Well, Seymour, at least you guard Gagazette as a Ronso, not a Maester. Yuna is much the same. <laughs> Elder Kelk. Let Biran rend them asunder. <laughs> no escape, not one. No, we will not flee. 
Well, we will fight and continue on. We just say you're not free. You die. You have been branded a traitor. But still, you would fight sin. Well, we didn't join Team Sin, if that's what you're asking. To the temple, hated by the people, yet you continue your pilgrimage? You continue to talk normally. Everything lost. What do you fight for? What do you fight for? I fight for close-ups of my prettiness. I fight for Spira. The people long for the calm. I can give it to them. I long for panning shots of it's my gardens. It's all I can give. Well, uh, Titus would like you to give up something for him. Defeating you know I mean? sin, ending pain. This I can do. No, you can't. Even sacrificing yourself. Well, that was always the rule. I mean... You had to know that. I'm too tired for this crap. I'm too old for this shit. Bronzo, let them pass. Summoner Yuna, your will is stronger than steel. Tempered steel that even the mightiest Ronzo could not hope to bend. Yeah, we could certainly crush you and your party. Yuna, we bow to your will. And your boobs, apparently. Now go! The sacred heights of That was like a Rumble Roses shot right you. there, especially with Lulu in the background looking on. We thank you. Many thanks for your not killing us. Alright, well I don't want to talk to people. I want to talk to people, but I don't want to accidentally talk to somebody who's going to like end this sequence before I talk to everyone, so... It's just a little farther now. It's a little bit farther now. It's a little bit softer now. It's just... It's just... Softer now. Eunice, grown stronger. Yeah. Stronger, huh? She's on uh, the sphere grid leveling up. I'd say it's more like she's driven. Don't you think? She's driven stronger than whatever. That's why she's strong. She's still pressing forward. Don't contradict me! When weak people are driven, they can't go far before they break. She keeps going forward because she is strong. It is because you are strong. Has can die. All I can do is try and keep up with her. All I wanna do is make love to you. <gasps> My neck's hurting. What? Xanarkin's on the other side. Huh. Yeah? You're home, yeah? As if you believed me. <laughs> Maybe I do. The one on the other side here is probably just a pile of rubble, yeah? But my neck's hurting for but some somewhere reason. Somewhere out there is your Xanarchy. Somewhere, yeah? Yeah, you'll be home soon enough. I hope you're right. Somewhere yeah, cheer up. Let's do this. Do this thing, yeah? Better get ready. Ain't no shops where we're going. Better get know, well, ready. Well, Waka will no probably teleport in randomly. It is as I thought. What is? Yevon is in turmoil. Micah tries to keep it whole, but it crumbles around him. Seymour's mass murders Look, are probably hard I to cover up. I couldn't care less what happens to Yevon. Because you are not of this world. To those who truly believe in the teachings, a time of much pain is coming. That's kind of a good point. It's easy for us to uh, get into these RPG, JRPGs with like evil saint, evil religions, but... Um, yeah, I mean, what happens to people after their religion is exposed to be false? Ten years ago, I looked up at Gagazet from where we stand now. My old man say anything? I do not remember. All I could think of was how... how I might keep Braska alive. Your duties as guardian will soon end. I'll be killing you tonight. Your duties... You think of anything yet? It's not really my speed of thought. I... there's just so little time. Uh... I don't know. Uh... Whew, this is a toughie. Uh... No longer play Blitzball. I thought we could play Blitzball. Why can't we play Blitzball again? 
young or old. So is he going to be like the Kel? Young or old, Ronto, all warriors, and all must protect. So now he's he's speaking. Uh, Sharp and Fangs till day of death. He's speaking like uh, you know, noble savage style. Biran and Yenke gone. I wonder what they're gone up to. Gone fishing. Eh, it's probably nothing. Yeah, if they're they're not going to show up and be a problem. I'm sure. Biran is hero of Ronso. Yenke is powerful warrior. Great. I hope we don't have to fight them. Kimari must fight. Kimari must win. The Sacred Gagazette. First time Kimari climbs. The Sacred Gagazette. Summoner Yuna's words. They ring clear in my soul. I will never forget the time she Small said, And now I know the food is the only way my heart. But a will that towers over Gagazette's peak. Small voice, small frame. See? It was an egregious bass. Keeps complaining about her, her voice. And she's, she's got her towers over Gagazette, dude. Fictional mountains can't even match this voice. And lined with the dens of fiends. Strong guardians, be prepared. And guard your summoner well. As guardians of the mountains, we might want to do something about the fiends. But it's a well-kept secret that we actually encourage the fiends to be around to test the summoner. It's pretty Guard cool. Your summoner with all your heart. Tear your heart out of your chest and throw it at enemies. Guard your I'm generic Ronso, baby. Uh, ooh, young Ronso, fight a treasure so strength, daddy. Beard on beat, Kamari, but Kamari never met losing not once. He was a spoiled little brat. Nigga been on broke Kamari's own. Kamari could not bear shame with that sacred mountain, daddy. I talk less after home broken. He used to talk like this, daddy. He used to be wolf man house all the time. Sometimes he started yelling, scoop. I'm Mike Lebronzo. We're so happy to see. I'll be off, because yeah, anyways. We're so happy to see Kamari back. It's almost like we have personalities and backstory. Who goes there? Uh -oh. Uh, haven't you bothered us enough? Summoner may pass. Guardians may pass. Kimari not pass. Kimari shame, Ronso brothers. Kimari forget his birth. Forget his people. Forget his mountain. Forget how to talk like Ronso. noble savage. Weakling, Ronso. Mountain hate the weak, hate the small. If you will So you and Riku are in trouble. Really hates the small. Then I must prove my strength. Think you will win? You not forget who took your horn. Never forget. I got your horn in my pocket, Kimari baby. Kimari never beat Brother Biran. Never win. Are they brothers? This time, I win. I will win. Brother from another mother? Why, you... Uh, this some kind of Ronso thing? No, it's a you man thing, a bitch, so stay out of it. Uh, Alright, daddy, I'm gonna beat you like the scroop you are. Uh, Alright. Viran, rend you asunder. It'd be fun for Viran. Hardless, hardless. Hardless. I can't remember the words of that song at all. Oh man, I didn't get set up with the full uh, overdrive meter. This is actually bad news. It's just a fairly easy boss fight, and it's a good chance to to learn some <coughs> Kamari overdrives, but. I kind of wish I had gotten the uh, full um, Kamari can learn many techniques. Blocks attacks on Yankee with guard, except when separated after performing a bulldoze. Cast Mighty Guard just once after losing HP. Let's get uh, 
Okay. Blocks attacks on Biran with guard, except on separate F1. Well, he casts White Wind. Okay. Mario's learned Doom! And he got a full overdrive meter out of that. Doom. Counts down to an enemy's Doom. Nah, I think I'd rather go with Bad Breath. It appears that he's completely immune, which sucks. And I got a full overdrive again. Let's see if any of them can be affected by... Um, and I learned something. I didn't even notice what stone breath, I guess. It's probably bad breath now that it's going to hit both of them. Surely somebody is able to be affected by something. I, well, he turned the wrong way. That's part of his problem. Raise my magic and magic defense since I seem to be using Lancet mostly here. This guy, I think, uh, Biran, uses more magic than Yankee, so, uh, unless I got their names backwards here. So if I'm gonna beat the physical attacker first, then having good magic defense would be good for the second half of the battle, but. You can see I'm sucking out more health now. Oh, he's not a unit power break. Yeah, he definitely has better magic than the other guy. This guy's got better physical attacks. Oh, that's right, they block each block attacks on Not each other. Good enough, Kimari. Kimari, you suck. Pretty epic battle, huh? Let's see what happens when I attack this guy. Nothing. I mean, I don't get through. I knew I wouldn't get through, but I figured he might say something cool. Get him down to halfway, I think he'll use Mighty Guard, and then I can actually learn Mighty Guard. One of the more useful of the uh, Ronso Rages. Although Bad Breath seems like it would be a great one, but it doesn't seem to be working all that well for me, at least not in this battle. <laughs> this is the strength of Kimari. Oh, he used it on both of them. I was really hoping that wouldn't happen. Well, what kind of sucks here is that I don't really have a, uh... He's got Shell and 
they now have shell and protect and all the null spells applied and there's really nothing I can do about that because I don't have a, a spell. I learned Mighty Guard. That's key. So just for funsies I'll get Mighty Guard going on myself. Might as well finish him off. Before I start working the other one. It's kind of a slow, boring way to win, but... It'll work. Oh, I should attack him now that he's over there. He's immune, but he's also down. I can't just pick on his corpse either. Now he's hastified too. Are you gonna go hang out with this guy's corpse? up and use white wind so that we can end it. I, I should be taking advantage of this opportunity to talk like uh, Wolfman Jack loud. Uh, ooh, you're just about done now, daddy. You had a good ride, but it's time for you to go hang out with this corpse and then join him. I knew I wasn't going to need Titus for this shit. Is he going to use white wind or not? I wonder if it would help for me to... I can't get... He doesn't seem to want to use White Wind. I don't think I can... Um... Yeah, I can't bring his buddy back to life so that he'll use it on both of them, but... Maybe when he gets down to, like really critical? Otherwise I'm going to have to learn it from something else. So learn to cast white winds just once after losing hit points. Yeah, I don't get it. There's other creatures out there I can learn White Wind from, and while it's a good overdrive, it's not as good as uh, Mighty Guard. No more chance to use it here. I think at this point he's pretty much proven he's not going to, but I'll more chance. And now I'm gonna have to cut you down. You win. I knew it, Daddy. I knew you a couple of bitches. Hey. And I got two return spheres. It's, I thought you got more impressive prizes for this fight than that. No. Oh, well. Strong is Kimari. 
Biran is strong is happy. Biran is Kimari. My loin cloth bristles with victory. I mean defeat. Well, whatever. Sacred Mount Gagazet. Listen up, Daddy. I honor the name of strong warrior who defeats Biran. Biran. Remember always, Gagazet. Gagazet. That name is Kimari. Uh, I'm a mountain. I don't really have a conscious mind. Mountain knows Kimari strong. Kimari may pass. This is a great moment in the life of my oldest father. Oh, am I kidding? I don't care about this. We run so will stop pursuers from temple. Truly? Penance for breaking Kimari's horn long ago. We crush enemies following behind. Where the best surprises always sneak up. Kimari crushed enemies standing before. A most fortunate summoner. Okay. I thank you. And the Ronso don't have any summoners. Ronso will shine your statue brightest. <sighs> thank you. I guess that's kind of creepy. But I fear that no one will make a statue for a traitor such as I am. Then Ronso will make such as I, not such as I am. With grand horn on head. Ah, uh, because summoners. That would be wonderful. Have horns in the Final Fantasy games for some reason. I wanted to see Yuna's statue too, but I wanted to see it naked with Yuna by my side. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess that's where you're going with that. All right, yeah, that makes sense too. You guys, got anything more to say to us? No bad feelings. They will praise Valiant Kamari. Uh, Wolfman. Generic uh, says someone at the front door, baby. Uh, yeah, clearly Yuna. Okay. Shoot from Yevon comes soon. Make haste. Said it. it must be the strength of Summoner that guide Kamari. It was some, something like that. And like, yeah. Clearly, Yuna's been giving Kamari workout tips. That's why uh, Kamari's almost as cut as Yuna is. What happened to Kelk? Maester Kelk. Seeker Knights of Gagas had shown the weak use Ronzo weapons. Can't afford them? Why are they grayed out? Probably I've got too many items and I need to sell some. Well, I'll worry about that off screen. But yeah, I'm thinking I probably do need to sell some items. That might be part of the reason why I don't have enough gold to hire uh, Fancy Pants' new um, what you call it, uh, Aeon. Wow, a female Ron. So listen to Wind Howl, Monk. Gagas at base, Kamari victory, mama. And it's another one. Why not, small guardian? We got your back, baby. And Don't worry, little daddy. We're going to be your hookup. And so, presumably, the forces of Bazel are, Bazel, Bavel are still chasing us, uh, but they're not so going to help us out. Nice plot reason why we won't constantly be attacked from behind. Oh, sorry, taking a second to adjust the uh, just my seating position here, more or less. All right, we are at the mountain trail, and uh, really looks like there's something back here. Oh, and there is. It's got to be hidden treasure or something. Yeah. 20,000 kill! Obtain 20,000 kill! Summoner Yuna! What up? No, you're, what you're is it this time? He's not a really patient guy, is he, Titus? Oh, you're awful! Stop! Please! Somebody gong these creeps! He is a handsome man, though. Look at that guy. That's a nice... 
what Yankee's got, unless he's Baron. Shut up! I really shouldn't be cracking so many jokes. It's, it's gonna be kind of affecting in its, in its way. Big butch manly, manly men on a big slab chest manly day singing manly songs of encouragement. Reminds me of a Hercules movie except that they're Muppets. Now they really don't sound like they're supposed to be Ronzo. They're just generic male singers now. And it's like, man, no pressure, huh? So I guess I can just give up the pilgrimage. Oh, wait, I guess I can. Everyone's singing all these songs. And oh, well, whatever. I'm inspired. I'm moved. Let's do this thing. Let's go kill us some sin. Oh, another treasure chest. Update. Mega potion times two. I was just kind of wondering. Ugh. Monster attack. I was just kind of wondering to myself. Shady Knights would be um, happy to be referenced Father, periodic. Give me strength. Give me the strength necessary to run away from these enemies. Grenades. I thought they were grenades. Purple bomb creatures are always called grenades for some reason in the Final Fantasy series. Yeah, but it's like I wonder if uh, Shady Knights uh, likes the fact that he's being referenced. And then I realized, oh wait, I don't know that he's actually watching these videos, so don't matter too much. Anyway, folks, that's going to be it for right now. Uh, Screen cursor. Always nice for people to have flee and cheer. Flee and slash. So yeah, we're gonna call it a video right here. Uh, when we come back, uh, well, when we come back, we're gonna start climbing the Sacred Mountain Gagazette, and um, the plot has informed us that the Ronzo are going to be fighting our pursuers. I don't know whether they really are pursuers, because the last pursuers from uh, Bevel popped up in front of us on the path and made some vague threats and then produced a giant robot. So um, we'll see what's going to happen next, folks. But uh, we definitely got to climb Mount Gagazette. We've been warned there's a lot of fiends, so... I don't know if you guys like this or hate it, but I do tend to flee from fiends, and I know that you guys get bored with that, but I can fight each enemy type grouping I meet once or twice. I mean, we'll figure out a way to make it work, folks. But the point is that plot-wise, we're really getting somewhere. On the other side of Mount Gagazette is Xanarkin, and I'd have to expect that some kind of uh, great questions and mysteries of the game will be solved when we get there, right? I guess we'll find out next time, folks. Mysterious JG, I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.